Do you ever have those days where you just have way too much time on your hands? Yeah, today's one of those days. So my plan is to go for a drive. Might take the laptop and just see what I can do. Just gonna have a bit of a drive around for a bit. See where we go. This looks like a nice place. So I know I seem to go on about writing a lot and it's probably doing your head in by now, but I'm actually really, really getting into it and I'm actually genuinely enjoying it. So I'm gonna... And who knows, one day I might even let you read it. So there's that. <laughs> Okay, that'll do. Back home now. All right, let's go. I gotta say, it is so weird being able to just drive along here as and when I want. Like the amount of times I come bike riding along here and now I'm driving along it, it's so weird. I don't think I'm ever gonna get used to that. Well, I said that, but I probably will. Still, fun. Okie dokie, slowly around here, there we go. <laughs> what I'm learning is driving would be a lot easier if I was the only person who ever drove. Like if it was just me in the road, fine, that'd be great, that'd be easy. It's the other cars that cause problems. Never me, always someone else's fault. And that, is life lessons with Joe. <laughs> I'm not ready to go home just yet. And what I mean by that is, it's currently home time from school-ish, and a lot of the school kids walk past my house along the street to get home. And I don't feel ready to try parking with a lot of school kids watching just yet. Could embarrass myself. So I thought I'd bring you here for a bit instead. kind of cold. Now it's time to head back. And I'm hungry. <laughs> All right, we made it. It feels like a little victory every time I manage to get it on the drive properly. Still uh, need to get the hang of that one. Some sort of fishing competition going on over there. I wonder who caught the biggest. 